All right, let's go back to the day after Thanksgiving. One of the greatest days in Razorback history. Beating the number one team in the nation. That's right. But let's be honest. There are those of you here tonight who failed to fully enjoy that victory because you thought it might mean that Houston Nutt would be back for another year. Be honest, you're out there. This song is for you. You're always a critic, Mr. Grinch. You're never satisfied. If the Hawks were ten and two, it's the two that bother you, Mr. Grinch. You are the dark side. It all started last year for Mr. Grinch. The Hogs were ten and one until Tigers and then Gators and finally Wisconsin, Mr. Grinch. Those three losses were followed by these three words, freedom of information. You like dirty laundry, Mr. Grinch. We learned coach likes to text. Sure, it showed bad judgment, but it's not like having sex, Mr. Grinch. Phone records, full page ads in the newspaper, planes flying banners. What on earth will be next? In Gus, you trusted Mr. Grinch. But he's gone, and so is Mitch. Some nasty emails blew it, sent by Teresa Pruitt, Mr. Grinch. Now those guys will be setting scoring records somewhere else, thanks to that beep. You wore a black shirt, Mr. Grinch. Just praying for the day when the head nut on the hill would smile away and say, Mr. Grinch. <clears throat> I love Arkansas. I was born in Arkansas, but I'm an old Miss Rebel today. The haters will live on, Mr. Grinch. You'll all be back next year when Petrino tries to win with no DMAC to fear, Mr. Grinch. But I promise you, if you don't stop complaining, I'm going to take matters into my own hands. And I've got that wood right here. Beep!